These people came from all parts of Bangladesh to attend this rally. I came to protest the enforced disappearances, murders and oppression that we have suffered for the past 15 years. This government is not safe anymore for even a second. At some point, violence erupted between opposition supporters and police in different parts of the demonstration in the capital, Dhaka. A policeman and an opposition activist were killed and hundreds of others were injured, including several journalists. Thousands of opposition party members were also arrested across the country. We couldn't even grasp what was happening. All of a sudden, we came to the rally like many other members, and they started arresting us for no reason. The main opposition Bangladesh Nationalist Party has called for a countrywide dawn to dust general strike on 29 October in protest against what they say is a police crackdown. Security has been tightened all across the country and in the capital, Dhaka. Tension remains high after the clash between opposition members and police. Security forces often accuse demonstrators of attacking them first. But rights groups say that many videos and witness accounts show that protesters are often harassed and beaten by the police first, and often with the support of ruling party supporters. I don't think so. All these uh, law enforcement agencies are for the people. They are the friends of the people. So they always maintain the law and order situation of the, uh, this area and all over the country. The government party Aumi League also held rallies across the country, but it warned rivals against staging unauthorized demonstrations. We will see who takes shelter where and in which area. Without permission, you expect to hold rallies and hide in the alleys. You will not have any escape route. We want to be clear on this. With the troubled economy and soaring cost of living, Bangladesh now faces the additional challenge of growing unrest and calls for a change of government ahead of general elections in January. Tanvi Chaudhary, Al Jazeera, Dhaka. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.